Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Leleen Lee and I'm doing a travel related video and I upload two to three times a week whenever it's possible. Alam nyo ba kung nasaan ang pusod ng Pilipinas? Yan ay matatagpuan dito sa Boreas Island. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Leleen Lee and I'm doing a travel related video and I upload two to three times a week whenever it's possible but at least I'm doing two videos a week by the way guys let me tell you what I am experiencing here now at Burias Island before I traveled to Burias Island um, I secured lots of documents travel documents so uh, I can cross the sea first we need to secure a medical certification travel pass from our barangay wherever you belong and then we also need a LGU coordinate certificate it's stating that you are accepted by the LGU of the municipal you are going like I'm going to Burias Island and the municipality is San Pascual so I coordinate with the LGU here in San Pascual and they give me a certification of acceptance. That's very important because they will ask you to uh, show them that you travel back to your province. And also after the medical certificate travel pass, you need to secure a travel authority from the PNP headquarters of the place where you, where you belong. As for me, I belong to Taguig City, so I get my travel authority from the PNP headquarters in Southern headquarters there at the Bonifacio. And by the way, you also need to uh, secure a swab test so that if they require you a quarantine on the municipal where you're going to, like in San Pascual, if you have a swab test, they will not require you to uh, have a 14 days quarantine on their facility and in my in my situation I have a home quarantine because I have a swab test result and um, I also secure a certification from uh, where I lived like I live in a condominium so they give me a certification that I, I am a owner one of the unit owner on the condominium and so now I travel with my folding bike Bayhon and this is my very important bag and over here is my tent my cooking tools my camping tools and my lamp and my how to say and all that I need for my travel so now I'm still um, under 14 days home quarantine so I just show you um, my situation here in in San Pascual Boreas Island
Hi guys, I am here at San Pascual Boreas Island, Masbate, and my companion here, Dehon, folding bike, and my tent. Um, I will finish my home quarantine at the end of this month. My plan, my original plan is to go around Masbate Island, the mainland of Masbate, but since uh, the coronavirus become more severe on that place and even in Tikaw Island there's uh, new co cases of pos positive coronavirus so my original plan is cancelled and I might just stay here at Bryce Island until mid of November and I'm gonna vlog around here so um, I hope you stay with me alam nyo ba kung nasaan ang pusod ng Pilipinas yan ay matatagpuan dito sa Boreas Island but uh, nagtanong-tanong po ako kung paano pumunta doon but they suggest not to go there uh, there's a very sensitive issue and very sensitive reason why I cannot go to there to that place uh, so I'm sorry if uh, my vlog here at Boreas Islands are very limited because of the coronavirus situation and the typhoons that keep on coming one after another so um, after here I might just gonna go back to Manila Thank you all so much guys for following my vlog and for uh, watching and Magabi na naman at ngayong gabi dito muna ako sa aking tent magpapalipas ng gabi uh, malapit naman ako matapos quarantine and typhoon is approaching again so guys look at the view here there's a horse there's a carabao the birds, fresh air, and I'm camping here just uh, beside of the quarantine facility of San Pascual because I'm allowed to have a home quarantine because I have a swab test so I'm lucky. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and then after my quarantine there's a lot of videos to come please follow and then subscribe if you haven't yet please like leave a comment and uh, god bless stay safe healthy and enjoy our life thank you all so much guys for subscribing for giving me a thumbs up and for sharing this video Please leave a comment down below and then um, I want to say thank you so much for inspiring me to do lots of videos going around places making vlogs. This is all for you guys. I dedicate all my vlogs to you. Thank you all so much. God bless.